All right, hello and welcome to another Marvel Snap deck highlight. Similar to yesterday, but a little different. Uh, I'm still messing around with Namora. I want to get a more optimized deck. There is a Lambie tournament on Sunday. Yeah, Sunday. Uh, and I would like to run Namora in it. <clears throat> she might not be the perfect card, but she's the card that I want to be running. So uh, that is the game plan, is to try and find a good deck uh, with a mix of good tech with the power output I need. Uh, the tech that this deck's going to be running is just <clears throat> Uh, location variants so uh, having the lockdown cards in um, do I bank on I don't think it's worth the gamble of hoping that Los Diablos hits big house we're in a better position if it does but I don't think it, the gamble's worth it um <clears throat> what was I saying oh the tech is mostly location variants in Storm, Jean Grey and Goose uh, just kind of locking down where our opponents can play but the issue that we run into is that um okay Uh, with the leaked OTA for tomorrow, uh, Bounce is going to absolutely roll this deck, I think. So, we just gotta find a way. Also, I took out Echo and accepted that, ah, Cosmo is just a bad matchup, we'll deal with it. Well, now dealing with the bad matchup, I fucking hate it. <laughs> Get me out of this hell. Um, our opponent's taking quite some time. Yeah, I'm just not even gonna bother with this game. It's not worth it. We get <clears throat> unlucky that they happen to play. Claw Cosmo left on their uh, Project Pegasus turn. Just go into the next one. Don't worry about it. So the important things I'm just trying to figure out with this deck are uh, how good is ongoing going to be? Uh, Spectrum's getting a point nerf. I don't think that's gonna it's like sway the needle one way or the other, but um, it could have a bigger influence than I think it will. Uh, and on top of that, okay, that's, you know, just not good. Uh, on top of that, with the Werewolf by Night buff that should be coming out, um, how big of an impact is that going to have? There's concerns for sure. So it'll just be interesting to see how everything ends up playing out. And we won't know until tomorrow. Today, as you're seeing the video. Tomorrow as I'm recording it. Uh, she play the demon out this turn? Um... I guess I goose left. Holy... what? <clears throat> we'll do that to just clear everything up. 
They're kind of running low on space. Or this could be a better play, actually. We could do this into a Nomura middle into Dr. Doom. What the fuck? Okay. I was trying to do the math there on if anything actually weird happened. It just did the animation twice. It didn't actually change anything. So yeah, we're gonna give plus five to Nebula. And then uh, we'll dock Doom to win the left. Because this is minus four normally. So we'd gain nine power. So we'd go to 11. The other option we would have is to Odin. But I don't think it's worth it. They still have a demon. They have a demon in hand somewhere. Um... I think this is the best play. They demon here. What's the other card they have? Like cannonball. Yeah, I mean, we lose to cannonball, right? They go demon cannonball, there's nothing we can do. Escaped. I mean, I'm just not going to reward boomer snapping, even if... I just don't think I could have won, because I think this deck runs cannonball. I, I'm slowly remembering that that card exists. Hop it in to another one. We have Shaw into Ironheart as an option. I don't hate the vault. Um. Storm throne word throne room throne room or we storm great portal or do we just shaw Nocturne's interesting. <sighs> Iron Lad can hit a lot of good cards. It can also hit Goose and make me depressed. God, I can't wait for that card to get nerfed. If we pull Doc Doom, we have an out. If we pull Doc Doom, we do not have an out. I want to play in Nomura middle.
Um, I mean, I think we're supposed to leave here. Not I think, we're definitely supposed to leave here. But I also think they can be scared enough that like they could think we have Doc Doom. Because if we have Doc Doom, they have to move Nocturne and play another card in the Iron Lad lane. Oh wait, this is wrong. This is wrong. That's that's the right play line. Because this is better than Doc Doom, actually. We go to 11 power right, uh, which bumps to 22, and then we get 12 plus 5, so we get 17 left. Um... Um... Please, don't hurt me. Sure. Victory. That is certainly a way that I could have won the game. I needed, what, a six power card. Yeah, I needed a card that was at Namora's power or greater, which I feel like is a majority of them. I'm not sure on that one, but I feel like it's a majority of them. But Ayo, top 30, baby. All right, hopping in to another one. It doesn't do, it does do something for us, like that. I'm thinking that Iron Lad probably needs to get swapped out in this deck. I feel like he doesn't really do a lot. I'm not really ever happy to see Iron Lad. And I feel like that's like kind of the way that Iron Lad should be. It's, you should be like always happy to see him. I'm like never happy to see him. I hate that he's here. Um... This is a Spectrum deck? Yeah, I think we Iron Lad hope to hit Namora. Um, yeah, this is the thing again, is I, I'm looking at Iron Lad and going, it feels like the right play. The other half of me is going, if I pull Goose, I'm literally molding. Like, is the other thing. So it's like, yeah. If we don't pull Goose, uh, I think we're fine. What do I do? I miss Marvel into Shaw Ironheart. Like, what's the what's the play line here? Cause I, I just Jeff right because they have Spectrum. All right, what's more power? Um, so this is 10 power, this is 16 power, no this is 14 power, it's 12 if it hits Shaw. What's the power middle, it's uh, 9 more power, they go up to 13. No, it's not true. They go up to 16. Why am I bad at that? Just, they go up to 16. We are at 10. We go up to 18. We're fine. 
No, we're not, because they owe. Oh, I forgot that Odin has more power than Spectre. Ayo! Ayo! What did they think I was going to do with Jeff? How, how was I going to get this super Jeff left? Oh, they were preparing for if I left, uh, Jeff left, and it got hit by another, uh, another iron heart fair i guess people should just really stop snapping into me it's like a superpower whenever they snap into me i just win the game you know with that statement i want to check the cube equity i have on this deck versus like the win loss because i feel like i'm losing a lot of games but like my win my cube equity is like positive my that I'm like losing that much. I would say that's not like that's incorrect. Oh, I can storm. I'll just storm here. Wind aid my hand. Fuck me. I think this is fine. Interesting. At some point, I just need to commit to turning off Superflow. I just don't know when that moment is. When do I embrace the pain? Is it right now? Might be right now. And because I played Goose Left, this is the turn I pull Nomura to make me just sad. Is this the Tribunal deck? I don't know, like I don't know what else this would be because I know that Tribunal runs Sarah and it's weird that Mr. Negative runs Sarah because it's like counterintuitive in my brain. Like you don't need to discount your zero cost cards. I don't even know what I want this Iron Lad to hit. <laughs> Couldn't tell you. Um, I don't know. Nomura. Ayo. Such is my judgment. Okay. They have an Iron Man, I guess. Iron Man, Mystique, Onslaught. Or just Iron Man, Mystique? That doesn't do a lot. Uh, If I do like this. 
this. I'm just aiming for fun at this point. Oh my, what the fuck? That's all their cards. There's a whole nother turn, my guy. Oh, they got my goose. Escaped. I guess he just didn't remember that there was another turn or something? Like, what? Very weird. Alright. Hopping into... Probably the last one. I swapped out Iron Lad for <laughs> Iron Lad for Sandman. Um, I'm looking at what I'm what my playline is gonna be here. It's Goose, to Shaw, to Miss Marvel, and then something, 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 something. Oh uh, man, I was gonna say maybe I should goose right to Shaw left, but Uh, so game plan on five is to Ironheart Jeff because then we're pulling Sandman or Doc Doom and we feel good if we pull out of those cards. Invisible Woman. I'm going to be fucking depressed. Doctor Doom. Ah, it doesn't matter. I did hit Doctor Doom. Hell yeah, two of them. Now it's super invisible. Uh, this is technically better because more cards left is better. It's also more power at middle. Victory. They didn't pull Hella. Or they were... Did we win middle? 14... 20 power middle? Does that sound right? Iron Lad, Modoc, Hella is 20 power middle. We would have lost middle. I would have needed to Jeff middle. Um, And then we would have won middle. We would have probably won Mer Island. So, probably we're fine. Anyway, if you guys enjoyed, please leave a like, comment, let me know, subscribe for you to check out, and I'll see you in the next one, the OTA video.